the time to spend in a spa. Plus, the sauna experience can be expensive. Not anymore! Introducing the revolutionary sauna pants! Okay, that's recording. Okay, so... I had this giant long intro planned out, scripted out for this video where I was gonna go through, unbox the sauna pants, you know, say, oh, so I asked people if they wanted to see any unbox the sauna pants. And then I fucking forgot to press record, so um, I opened the box off camera, what I thought was on camera. So I'm gonna reenact, to the best of my ability, what, what just happened five minutes ago. Okay, so I unboxed the pants. I found multiple shit stains, which is kind of worrying me. Um, let me show you a few. There's one here. This is either fucking feces or mold. I don't know which one would be worse. Um, there's like six of those on the surface area of the pants. Um, maybe, maybe that's from all the sweat from the last owner. I can't imagine these are brand new. They, they smell. They smell. So I guess I guess it's like a glorified heating pad at the end of the day because it has this little little thing with which has a protection setting on it. Th that worries me. That worries me. There's a lot of like symbols on here, like tube and gis. I I hope I'm alive after this video. It came with no instructions. It literally these were not even boxed. Wait. Okay, I might have lied. I think it came with instructions. So it has a rule, a measurement, a ruler, and um, what appears to be instructions, I'm thinking. Nice hot guy in the front, sell the product. Sauna pants, vital form, instruction manual, and diet. Holy shit, two in one. Okay, so warning. That's a lot of warnings. I'm gonna fucking die. There's actually a diet on here. Tuesday dinner is a potato and half a red pepper. Friday's breakfast is orange juice. That's it. No wonder this shit gets results. Let me read the lunches from Saturday to Sunday. Lemon tea and watermelon. One cup of low-fat yogurt. An apple. One cup of low-fat yogurt. And a peach. That's dinner for a week. Okay. Well, I won't be trying that, but I will be... To reduce the risk of burns, electric shock, and fire. For best results, I should use the Vital Form sauna pants for 50 minutes at a time. Do not exceed, in all fucking bold and capital letters, do not exceed 50 minutes per session. I am genuinely kind of worried. It doesn't really have any, I mean, I, I can kind of get the idea of the instructions. I use these to wrap it around me and then turn them on. I want to know what the numbers mean before I just start I'm cooking myself. So there's a low and there's a high. So I guess everything in between there is just in between there. Drinking hot drinks such as milk, blah, 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 is recommended. Do not drink. Could drinks. No, I didn't see that shit. No, because I'm not pointing to it. Could drinks. Okay, so we already got multiple typos. This is, this is a really really bad idea, but I'm gonna do it anyways because I already bought them. So, let's begin. Hey, don't really know where to do this. Do I wanna marinate my couch with my own ass sweat? Because that's looking like the best location. I think it's safe to say I'm regretting this purchase. I have to, t I have to tuck my hoodie in, otherwise they'll fall off. I have them on the tightest setting and I have to waddle to make sure they stay up. I don't know how I'm going to record the testing of this. Um, you might just have to take my word for it. I haven't thought that far. The cord, <laughs> the cord is like four feet long. Not very user friendly. For the next version of the sauna pants, you should extend it. This manual has me so scared I'm gonna get shocked, but for you guys, I, I still really don't want to do it, but I'm going to. Let's go. They're plugged in. I'm gonna scoot on up here. Okay. I've got them plugged. This is gonna be kind of difficult. <laughs> I got one cord entering here. 
going over there. It's like this long to begin with. So we're gonna start on low power. I don't wanna turn these on. Ha! Okay. Here we go. I'll check back in a few minutes. It's getting warm. Ooh, I don't know if I like this. I don't think I like this. Let's turn it up. I'm on a six right now. And I'm not feeling a whole lot. Ooh. It's like only working in like the leg part. It's a strange camera angle for what I'm doing. But I mean, what, what else am I supposed to do? Come back here? Or, Core won't reach. I'm gonna turn it up to high. I'm sorry, I'm not talking a lot. I'm like genuinely nervous that these are just gonna fucking spontaneously combust. Okay, I'm starting to feel it in my ass. But, ooh. Ooh, maybe I spoke too soon. Well, that is warm. That is very warm. Okay, I don't know how long I should be waiting to like let these warm all the way up. It's been like 10 minutes and I've had it on high for like five. It's warm, but it's definitely not enough to make you sweat. And I'm wearing a hoodie. I am finding more mold, ooh, right on, right on the crotch. More mold with every, every pass I take. There's pockets. What, is that a... There's, a, there's pockets. I don't think that's pocket. Well, what else would that be? They try to stand up without unplugging everything. It's got like a little, a little dude. What are you supposed to keep in there? Oh, they could like keep food warm or something. I think I know what I want to do with these pants. Okay, so since these aren't really giving me the sauna experience. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if there's a dual purpose of these pants. I have a frozen burrito in that fridge. Do you, do you see where I'm going with this? Okay, I got my pants back on. I am going to try to heat up a burrito in these pants, mold and all, because who wants to see me sit in a chair and be mildly warm. I wouldn't want to watch that. Boom, Tina's Bean and Cheese Burrito, not sponsored. So I'm gonna try to locate the warmest part of these pants. Ooh, ooh, okay. I think it's gonna be right in this crevice. So I'm gonna place the burrito right there, crank up the heat, well I guess it's already on the max setting, and we're gonna see what happens. Let's begin. Okay. So here, here we are. Let me get all the ice crystals off this so I don't electrocute myself. Okay. This is really fucking stupid, but I'm gonna do it anyways. I'll be back. Okay, so that marks 30 minutes. Let's check on our burrito. Ooh, it is, it is pretty hot in here actually. Oh my God, wait. I think I, must, I think I must stuck in hot for cold. That is actually, I mean, that's, that's squishy. It's getting there. Ooh, look at that. That is, that is not bad. Let's toss it in for another 30 minutes, see what happens. Okay, so that marks another 30 minutes on our burrito journey. Let's see where, oh my God. 
That is... Oh, that's not good. That's like burning the plastic off. Ooh, that's, that's not good. I'm, it's hard to do with one hand. Okay, sorry about that. That is, that is like fully thawed. Oh, I'm not even in, in focus. That is like, it's warm. I could eat this. My house smells like a chemical mixing plant. I don't know what they put in these pants, but I, I have a feeling that it's not FDA approved. But, anyways, some closing statements. Um, if you're looking for a substitute replacement of a sauna, don't buy these. If you're looking for a substitute replacement for a microwave, also don't buy these. It, it took, what was that, an hour? To heat this up. And it tastes like cancer. Well, I hope you enjoyed this awkward review of these glorious pants. Um, now, since I've likely taken 10 years off of my life and probably an extra year for every bite I take of this burrito from making this video, I think it is only fair that you like and subscribe. I think that's a pretty, pretty balanced transaction, if not leaning in your favor. Um, I would appreciate that. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Well, that was disappointing. I was expecting all the amenities of a sauna from the comfort of my own home from these bad boys. I will be contacting my lawyer to pursue a false advertising case. And I advise that you contact your lawyer to pursue an assault case, because if you don't subscribe to August the Duck, I will be forced to uppercut your grandmother.